On December 4th, 1963, Eastern, under the direction of head coach Jim Bechtold, christens its brand new playing facility, Alumni Coliseum, with a 78-65 win over the University of Louisville. In 1964-65, Eastern secured the OVC Championship as Bechtold was named OVC Coach of the Year and guiding the Maroons to a final 13-1 league record. Eastern, who scored more than 100 points five times that season, made its third appearance in the NCAA tournament before losing in the first round to DePaul. In the 1967-68 season, Eastern 6'9 center Garfield Smith finished second in the nation in rebounding to the University of Florida's Neil Walk as he completed the season with a school record 19.7 rebounds per game average. Later that year, Smith became a first round draft choice of the Oakland Oaks of the American Basketball Association and a second round pick of the Boston Celtics of the NBA. The following year, guard Bobby Washington closed his brilliant Eastern career with 1,221 points and was selected by the Baltimore Bullets in the NBA draft. Coach Guy Strong led his Eastern squad to the All-College Tournament Championship in December of 1971 when the Colonels defeated Texas Tech, Santa Clara, and Oklahoma City to take one of the nation's oldest Christmas tournaments. That same season, Eastern tied for the OVC regular season championship with Moorhead State and Western Kentucky, requiring a playoff in Frankfurt Civic Center to decide the league's representative to the NCAA tournament. Moorhead State defeated Western, setting up the championship game with EKU. Eastern downed the Eagles 98-86 to win the OVC crown and advance to the NCAA tournament. EKU, with a starting five of George Bryant and Billy Burton at guard, Charlie Mitchell and Daryl Dunnigan at forwards, and 6'11 Dan Argabright at center, was matched against Florida State, the eventual NCAA tournament runner-up, and took the Seminoles to the wire before losing 83-81. Eastern basketball fans caught a glimpse of the next OVC championship team on February 15, 1979, when the Ed Byer coached Colonels, en route to a 21-win year, defeated the West Virginia University Mountaineers 93-91 at Charleston Civic Arena. Later that same season, in one of the most talked about games in Eastern sports history, reserve guard Dave Tierney hit two free throws with no time left on the clock to give Eastern a memorable 78-77 victory over arch-rival Western Kentucky in the finals of the OVC tournament in Alumni Coliseum. The win sent Eastern to the NCAA tournament, where the Colonels, led by the nation's third leading scorer in Turk Tillman and second leading assist man in the country in Bruce Jones, were defeated 97-81 by the University of Tennessee. In 1986-87, Austin P. guard Richie Armstrong spoiled coach Max Good's Colonels' dreams of going to the NCAA tournament when he had a three-point shot at the buzzer to give the Governors a 71-68 win over Eastern in the finals of the OVC tournament. The 2000-2001 season was highlighted by guard Lavoris Jerry as he ended his Eastern career in style by scoring 41 points against Eastern Illinois in his last game as a colonel. In the 2004-2005 season, coach Travis Ford led Eastern to a school record 22 wins as the colonels, paced by EKU's all-time leading scorer Matt Witt, and the school's eighth all-time leading rebounder Michael Haney captured its last seven games of the regular season en route to taking the OVC crown. Eastern had to play Kentucky in the first round of the NCAA tournament and took the Wildcats to the wire before losing 72-64 in the RCA Dome in Indianapolis. Eastern's success on the court continued in the 2006 and 2007 season when freshman Josh Taylor's floating 10-foot jumper with two seconds left gave Eastern a thrilling 63-62 win over Austin P in the OVC Tournament Championship contest that secured the school's seventh trip to the NCAA tournament. Eastern lost to National Power, North Carolina, 86-65 in Winston-Salem, North Carolina, in the NCAA's first round. Leading up to the 2009-2010 season, 1,095 victories, 7 trips to the NCAA tournament, 11 OVC regular season or tournament championships, 52 all-conference players, 28 players either drafted or selected to play in professional basketball leagues. This is Eastern Kentucky University Basketball.